unmuting. Let's go ahead. There we go. Yeah, you're sweet. You're sweet for the mama. You have an eye burger? You have an eye burger. There we go. All right. Uh, let's... let's get so many eye burgers. Yeah, no, that was a bad, that was, that was a bad one. <sighs> Gawain is so strong. The power he met with me with in the arena surpassed my expectations. Caster's attacks didn't even put a scratch in his armor. Master, are you worried? Don't be. This guy's no different from the rest of your enemies. Look at it this way. None of your opponents have been easy. But you ended up trouncing every single one of them. So you'll win this time too. And even if winning all of those was luck, then you have the luck to win a thousand times. Tamamo will be your lady luck, guiding the dice however many times it takes. That's right. Not a single fight has been easy. I just need to do... So it, what, hmm? what she's saying is she'll be your one-up girl. <laughs> Thank you, Pauline. I want to legit learn how to sing that song. <laughs> yeah, I just need to do the same thing one more time. Just once more. I shouldn't worry because I have Ronnie as my ally. Ah, uh, yes, with Tamamo, this is truly the harem route. Let's see. Do, 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 do. Is there anything in the library? Nope. Yep, she's here. She's got that yellow uh, ellipses on, uh, over her head, so. You fought against the servant of the Harway Scion? I tell Ronnie about my encounter with Gawain, who I fought against the previous day. His name which bears no shame, the blade that shines like the sun, his apparent invincibility. He may be strong, but why other than hubris did Gawain reveal his true name to you? I wonder if the legends of him receiving divine protection have an element of truth to them. As long as the sun shines, Gawain might be the mightiest legendary soul, even greater than Arthur. The Power of Legend Gawain's exploits are described in detail in the Knights of the Round Table mythos. It's said that he is a hero who was blessed with great powers by the sun. Now that I think about it, his abilities seem to be taken straight from the legends. However, even heroes can die. And in the end, Gawain, too, will succumb to death. No matter how powerful he may be, he cannot escape the ties that bind him to his legend. Per the legend, if one were to overcome his greatest strength, he'll be left vulnerable. The stories say Gawain died by the hand of Sir Lancelot, who waited until the sun set to strike what became a fatal blow. But in the Seraph, the arena days are controlled by the system. I couldn't imagine the sun setting while well inside there. Then I shall have to block out the sun. Unfortunately, my power is such that it only be for a moment, but... And I can't guarantee... <laughs> Suddenly I can't talk. And I can't guarantee it'll work. While Ronnie's power as a magus is without question, to use such an advanced technique, I wonder if there is something I could do to help. This will take a great deal of focus, so... I'll need a place where I won't be interrupted. At first, I couldn't think of a place on campus that a magus could work without bother. Maybe the multimedia room that Julius was using before? But the secret to gaining access to it probably died with its original occupant. For now, I'll poke around wow. the multi- Rami? Yeah? You are- you, you are cutting out a lot. Uh, hmm. 
Yep, I see. I see the uh, the thing is on yellow, and red, yellow. Yeah, that's a really high ping. I'll go ahead and hop out of the voice chat then. Hop back in. Uh, we'll see. Okay. Actually, wait. Hold on. Did it stabilize? Because it's on green now. Maybe it did? I don't know. <sighs> Discord. Fix your shit. Alright. For now, I'll poke around the multimedia room. Maybe I'll find a clue about how to get in. Uh, multimedia room is over here, I thought. The multimedia room. This place must have facilities that support extensive hacking. I place my hand on the door and wonder how to get in. I knew it. I heard a mild electric shock when I touched the door. It's been booby-trapped. It's a trap! If nobody can get in the door except for Julius, what are we going to do? Break it down? I have an idea. Break it down now! <laughs> if only Julius can enter, then I have then I just have to pretend to be Julius. How I'm going to masquerade as the guy, I don't know. If only I had something of his. Anyway, I'll go look around the place where I fought Julius. Maybe I'll find a clue. So I would have to go back to the first floor of the arena. Let's see. So, did you find it? The object that grants wishes? The teacher's emblem. This isn't it. <sighs> Please, you have to get it for me. Come on, you'll try again, won't you? If I must. Thank you, thank you, thank you. You have my gratitude. The object that grants wishes has to be on the arena's second floor. It just has to. That area is probably over the sea right now, so... Everything should be copacetic. After two days' time, I won't be able to see you again, so please get what I asked for before then. Okay. All right. So if we go back to the first floor... And we go back to where we fought Julius... One of Julius's possessions. We need a bit of his data in order to fool the protection protocols placed on the multimedia room. Perhaps I should go to where he and I fought and where he disappeared. I might be able to find something of his there, or at the very least, some kind of clue. There isn't much time left in the prep period. If I don't look into it today, I may not get another chance. I should be a bit more cautious when I go exploring.
I messed that up. Oh, and I don't think I safe stated before I went into the arena. Shoot. Do, do, do. Speed through. Let's try this again. <clears throat> 